What's up everybody and welcome back to another episode of Lake Monster Lures and in this video I've had this sign up on my wall for a while and I was looking at these lures and I was like maybe I can recreate one of these things and moreover I was looking at these ones with this like fin on the back you don't see those very often being used in today's bass fishing so that inspired me to make this video obviously you know what you're getting into I think they look like a baby shark, which honestly, I hate that song probably as much as you do, if not more, as I am an elementary school teacher and I hear it way too much. But it's the inspiration for the video, so I'm gonna make one. Make sure to hit the like button. Let's get into it. Here are some fun facts. Okay, so Baby Shark, it, uh, it's a song, man. It, it originated as a camp song, and nobody really knows for sure who created it or where it was created. But it was created way back in the day, probably in the, like, the 1980s, 1990s maybe. And uh, so in the year 2016, this song became extremely popular when Pink Fong, a South Korean entertainment company, released a version of the song on YouTube. The video went viral and was the first video to ever surpass 11 billion views on the platform, which uh, knocked Desper Despacito, Des uh, another song. I'm sure you're like yelling at me right now, like, dude, it's whatever. Um, but yeah, that was at 7.5 billion views, and now this is like the most popular YouTube video of all time, and it is believed that the song was originally inspired by the movie Jaws. And there are many different versions of the song, which include lyrics that depict the actions of the different sharks, ranging from hunting fish to eating sailors and ultimately um, killing people who then would go to heaven. So not all that bad, but still, some of it you might not want your children to hear if you have children. Uh, yeah, so many of these versions of the songs have obtained copyrights, but the original song is public domain. And of the 11 billion views on YouTube, uh, the video only actually has 37 million likes. So I guess it just goes to show you that people don't hit the like button. So maybe you should hit the button? Like, hit, li hit like on this video. I'd really appreciate it. It helps boost the algorithm and, uh, yeah, more people will actually see my, my videos, please. Anyway, Baby Shark even broke into the official billboard on the Hot 100 songs, capping at 32 on the chart. The success of the song, dance, and video gained in the attention of television networks and eventually was adapted into a cartoon by the Nickelodeon network. It has been adapted into a musical, it has merchandise, it's done advertisements, and even walk-up music for professional athletes. While the English version simply lists the members of the shark family, the Korean version says Mommy Shark is pretty and Daddy Shark is strong and Grandma Shark is kind while Grandpa Shark is cool. These lyrics have been ostracized for being sexist. In July of 2019, officials in West Palm Beach, Florida, were criticized for playing the continuous loop of Baby Shark throughout the night outside their waterfront lake pavilion as a way of deterring homeless people, vagrants that is. So this song is literally torture. In October of 2020, two former detention officers and a supervisor at an Oklahoma County jail were charged with two counts of misdemeanor cruelty to a prisoner in conspiracy for forcing inmates to listen to the song on loop at loud volumes while standing handcuffed for an extended period of time. So yeah, here's the lure. I hope you enjoy the video. Like I said, hit the like button and yeah, done with the facts. There it is, baby shark. It's got a very tight 
tight wobble to it. You should be able to catch something on that, I think. It's a bit heavy, but if it's just do a yo-yo retrieve, like a lipless, I think that will trigger a bite. And I really want this thing to get bit for many reasons. One, to prove that I'm good at fishing and I'm good at making lures and also because I want to catch a fish. I have a feeling it'd be a pike more than anything else at this time of year. So, whatever. Toothy, slimy, I'll catch it. It definitely wiggles a lot. I would prefer to have a rattle in there to call them in a little bit better, but it looks great going through the water. Probably gonna hit up this other spot that has more vegetation and is a little bit more uh, shallow and has sun. Let's see if we can't get a pike. See that right there. Wobble, 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 wobble. That is pretty good looking. Um, minus, minus the grass. Oh, there's a fish. Oh, oh my God. It got off. Any tooth marks? Freight line? Anything? Dude, I swear I had one on. Try the other color. Oh yeah, those fish are bugging out. I just got hit. Commit, you fools. That was a that was a bite.
Well, unfortunately, I did not catch a fish using the baby shark. I did have a few bites, but a few bites don't count. I will have to reuse this in the future because it is now way too cold outside. There is snow all over the, the ground and moreover, there's ice covering the lakes. So we're gonna be doing some ice fishing. We're gonna be doing like a seasonal video coming up real soon. Uh, I got a special going on for Christmas. And yeah, make sure you hit the subscribe button. Stay tuned for the upcoming video. Thanks for watching this one. Hit the like button and I'll see you next time.